Carolina, I love you more than you could ever know. My steely exterior may not help, but I'm convinced that even the most outward personality couldn't manage to express the extent to which I've fallen for you. When I started writing these vows, I wanted to promise you the world, but I realized that first, I needed to tell you why. Four years ago to this day, we began our relationship, and every day since, you've been more beautiful to me than the last. I've never met someone so caring and loving and selfless. You give yourself fully to those around you without even a moment of thought, and you gave yourself to me. From our first day together, dancing salsa until the sun came up, I have felt nothing but loved. When Alex asked me what I liked most about you, I said your laugh. I said that because when you laugh, I know you've been given back a small bit of the happiness that you give others. And when I'm the reason for that happiness, I feel like I can do no better thing in my life. Today, I want to promise you the world, but even if I fail, I promise to never stop trying to bring you that happiness. I promise to try and live up to your heart and your soul. I promise to always strive to be a better man than I was yesterday, not for myself or others, but so that I might be able to provide for you what you've given to me. Carolina, I promise I will always love you. John, 13 years ago, you asked me out for coffee, which apparently meant asking me out on a date, but I just didn't know that. And I'm so glad that I don't drink coffee because even though it took you nine years to ask me out again, I wouldn't have it any other way. I've always felt so comfortable around you and the connection we built as friends first has only made our relationship stronger. So when exactly four years ago today, I opened the door to find this guy with long hair <laughs> standing on my front porch, I had no idea that my life was going to change for the better. I love our love story. We have grown so much together in these past few years and shared so many wonderful memories. I don't think I have smiled this much in my whole life, and that's because of you. I love you more than, <laughs> more than I even knew how much, and I love you more and more every day. You have always been there for me, even when we were just friends, and I vow to always be there for you. I promise to be there to celebrate your accomplishments, whether big or small, because you deserve every recognition. I promise to be the crutch you can lean on when you're going through difficult times and to take on some of your burdens so you don't have to. I promise to be the best wife I can be to you and the best mother I can be to our future children. I promise to continue to grow with you, learn with you, laugh with you, and to try new things and go on new adventures with you. <laughs> Lastly, I promise to continue to love you every day until forever. <laughs> I love you. And now, by the power vested in me, by the Universal Life Church, and by the beautiful state of Rhode Island, I am happy to pronounce John and Carolina as husband and wife. John, you may kiss the bride.
that this amazing couple is going to have a lifetime of happiness because of the liveliness and the fun that the two of you bring every day to the relationship. And I know that I can say this, that I can tell that there's real love based on how they look at each other. And I think that was definitely clear during the ceremony today. Committing to an amazing woman like Carolina is one of John's biggest accomplish accomplishments to date. What a perfect fit John had found in Carolina. They say, you don't marry someone you can live with. You marry the person you cannot live without. That sums up Carolina and John perfectly.